<laughs> You're in trouble. You might be in trouble. You ready? This is intimidating me for real. Why? I don't know. It's just a lot more than I expected. <laughs> you thought we were just going to have one of those like little arm throwers? Yeah, like slingshot thing. <laughs> so then I could throw it and then maybe alter you a little bit. Oh, okay. So this is going to be a 1v1 competition. Husband versus wife. We have an official skeet thrower. This thing slings them. I'm worried that Kenzie might not even be able to hit it. And me. I haven't shot the old shotgun in a while. So we got box of skeets. Box of skeets. And we just got back from Academy. Ended up picking up some 20 gauge shells because we don't want Kenzie having to shoot the old 12 gauge and I'm making her old. Not, I'm not doing that again. Making her old shoulder. <laughs> Can we cut to the cliff of the turkey loads? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Woo! What'd you think? That one hurt. That one hurt? Ow! <laughs> I'm deaf and I can't put my shoulder. <laughs> I was so sore. <laughs> so we're trying to save Kenzie's shoulder. We got three box of the 20 gauge. We're ready to rock and roll. We got the skeet thrower set up. All we got to do is take it out into the pasture, set the old bad boy up, get it slinging them skeet in the right direction, the old clay pigeons. And hopefully me and Kenzie will be able to hit it. If not, you won't be able to see this video because it will never post it. <laughs> But we're still coming up with the rules. We could do we could do uh, an amount for ten, like okay. however you have however many out of ten, like mm -hmm. one out of ten, and then how, maybe a timed version. Okay. I don't know. We're coming up as we go, but it is going to be a full on competition today. Bragging rights at the farm versus me and Kenzie, and we're also getting Kenzie ready for dove season. She's never dove hunted before, and this is about the closest thing to shooting doves, so. You're getting yourself ready too. Yeah, I'm also getting myself ready. I'm never prepared. Usually I don't shoot skeet before season or anything and just go out there and see how many boxes of shell we can go through. So this year, hopefully we'll be a little bit more prepared and ready for dove season. Cause we have uh, three weeks, three, maybe two to two and, a half. two and a half, three weeks till dove season. I'm trying to talk Kenzie into going dove hunting with us. So make sure you comment below. Kenzie, go dove hunting with Tristan for the very first time. Today if I'm going. If not. you're good, if you're... If, I, if I'm good, I'm going. If I'm not, I'm not going. Okay. <laughs> How many years has it been since you shot skeet? Eight years. Eight? Eight. No excuses. When's the last time you shot skeet? Last night? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> we are family friendly. No, bro. Uh, probably six months ago. We got my boots on. <laughs> Baby, it's you ready? sweat from here down. You, you ready now, girl? Come on now, cowgirl. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> come on, come on now, cowgirl. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. That, will that mess up? I don't know. Mm. Well, there's your answer. What's your predictions right now? I think we're both going to be a little rusty in the beginning. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And then, and then, the competition is going to like really start. Uh. We get practice before, right? Sure. Okay. Dalton, what's your predictions? Ow, for what? It is going to be crap. For what? It's a one v one competition between me and Kenzie. Ooh. Mm. Is Kenzie using a tripod? Damn! <laughs> I'm confident it's just shoot and skeet, but Kenzie, I don't know. I, she might be sandbagging us right now, so she might be good, but hopefully I beat her. Hey, man. Hey. Bro. Take your nightgown off before you go. Take your nightgown off before you go. Who just allergic to grass? Say, nobody knows how it is to have allergies. It's always what I see, too. Load them up. Did y'all check these for spiders? Maybe. There's no spiders in the can am. Oh, sure, you're Stanley? I hate these things. Everybody loves these things, I hate them. Because they're just so big and for no reason. I know the competition has started, but if there's any other competitions that you think me and Kenzie should try, comment below. Maybe compound bow versus crossbow. I don't know, give us some ideas in the comment section for uh, some stuff that we can compete in, you know, where I, I won't just win. Something that 
a little, maybe, maybe a little bit more fair. This isn't fair? I feel like this is pretty, well, no. <laughs> <laughs> Sipping on my sweet tea. Sweet tea, just getting a little energized. Yeah, let's do this 30 days before we cut eggs. I'm tired. Hopefully the battery works. Fire and hole. Oh, hey. shoot. Where did that thing go? Golly. It's still flying, look. <laughs> Tristan, stick your hand in there. What? Stop, don't do that. Stick I'm not. It. Oh my gosh! Sorry, middle's off. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I didn't mean to. Dude, I about got razor scootered to the shin <laughs> and my fingers Hurry are up. almost gone. Are you sure it's, it's off? off? That was so scary. Good thing I don't trust you. <laughs> Oh my god, I still have my fingers, thank the Lord. Yay! Oh, okay, okay, okay. They're flinging pretty good. We're gonna get set up over there with the old shotties and get a little practice in before we start this competition. Boom! <laughs> how do you how do you shoot with two eyes open? Think you're ready? No. <laughs> Alright, let's see what you got. Take it off safety. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well you got two more shots. Okay. <laughs> that first one was <laughs> <laughs> you got lucky. Pull. Ready? Pull. Oh my god. Took two shots, but I got it right there at the end. A little rusty, a little rusty right now, but right now we're tied. We are tied right now, so first round of practice, what are you thinking? Um, that I, first shot, you was it beginner's luck or were you just? No, because I really, I felt really good about it in the last two. I don't know. What <laughs> I did the same exact thing I did the first time I missed, so maybe it was beginner's luck. I don't know. Not feeling too confident about the competition, but I don't think Kenzie is either. So, <laughs> <laughs> all right, we got to load her back up. These are the skeet for the competition. Okay. On a serious note though, I know I know we're not shooting great, but it is it is fun. Yeah, it's a lot of fun, but I feel better that you're not doing as good either. Yeah, I mean I'm not doing great either. Hello, senor. I'm filming a skeet throwing shooting. <laughs> yeah, it's really just throwing, but we're doing a skeet shooting competition. Yeah, we're not doing too hot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We haven't started the competition yet. Ah, uh, my money's on Kenzie. <laughs> Senor said his money's on Kenzie. <laughs> Round one, here we go. How are we going to decipher who goes first? Um, we're going to decipher them. You just do rock, paper, scissors? Okay. Just rock, paper, scissors, shoot two out of three or what? Two out of three. All right, ready? Go. Shoot! Dang it! <laughs> okay, what is she gonna do here? All right, I got it. Ooh, <laughs> see, I knew what you're doing. <sighs> I did rock. No, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> All, All right, Kenzie's up first. She won. What? <laughs> All right, I'm up first. Ten ski. Hopefully, ten shots. Hopefully, I win this one. Here we go. We're only doing five pigeons since we don't have that many, so we're going five this time. One out of five. All right, here we go. Round one. Pull. <laughs> You're in trouble. You might be in trouble. That's one out of five. Here we go. Pull. Oh! Was I sandbagging you? That's rude if you were. <laughs> I honestly think I'm just getting lucky here. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Maybe I just needed to get a little bit more warmed up, Ken's. I don't know. That's three for three. We got two more for round one. All right, after those shots, what are you thinking? You a little worried? I mean, a little bit. Like, oh, I, maybe I should have gone first. I'm rethinking everything. <laughs> All right, I have two more, two more shots, so. Maybe I miss. Give me that thing. <laughs> Pull. Mm. 
Ready? Cool. Ah, oh, man. That was five. That was a good round for me. <laughs> five for five. Kenzie, you're up. Okay. Round one. This is so annoying. You Honestly, got should have went first. <laughs> All right, you got it. Come on. Okay, pull. Well, I lost. Well, you got to We got four more pigeons to see what you can do. Oh, now I'm pissed. <laughs> I don't even want to do this anymore. <laughs> All right, pull. I'm really pissed. Hey, hey. <laughs> can I stand over there? You can stand this wherever. This is not a good angle. Wherever you want. This is number three. All right, pull. Will it even reach that far? <laughs> yeah, it's just, you just got to try to get it as fast as it, it's coming out. Okay, well, that would have been nice to know before, but sure. I quit. You and Dalton play. <laughs> Kenzie did good. She was doing good earlier, but she doesn't want to. She doesn't want to compete anymore. We're still gonna get her to shoot some skeet because she does have to get prepared if she's gonna come duff hunt. But I think we can compete with Dalton. It is hot. Do you want to go first? Or you want me to go? We'll just alternate. Okay. Bring a box of shells. Yeah. All right. Alternating shots. Well, alternating clays. And uh, he'll go. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go. And then we'll see. Who's the winner? All right, Dalton's up first. All right, round oh. one. Oh, he came to play. Oh. One to one. One to one, baby. Oh. Oh. Dalton's putting on the pressure right now. Oh. I missed. I missed. No. All right. What is it? You got two. Uh, two to one. Wait. Yeah. This is number three. Three, five, six. I'm saying at least two out of five doves are gonna be in trouble this year. Oh no. Right now, me and Dalton are tied up. If I hit this one, we'll be tied up. All right, we're tied up right now, going to the last pigeon. Place your bets in the comments right now, Dalton or Tristan. Boom. Oh. All right, it is, it is super hot. We're gonna go, we're just gonna pull until Dalton misses, and then I'll have my shot to pull until he misses, or till I, till I miss. And whatever number that is, will be the winner. Oh. Well, that was quick. <laughs> that was one. Oh no. <laughs> Alright, I'm up. All I have to do is hit one, and this competition is over. I don't know. I'm a little worried, honestly. For some reason, Dal Dalton's loading up. <laughs> <laughs> all right, this is for all the marbles. Here we go. Pull. Oh, <laughs> right at the end. Did you get it? Yeah. Wow. Took three, but. Good job, man. Good job. Sorry, we need more practice. Yeah. <sighs> it's hot. Dove season's gonna be just as hot, but we're excited. Dove season's gonna be fun. Hey, let me try to hit two. Yeah, we're gonna try to do some dove. We're gonna try to be doing some challenges with the boys out on the dove field. So y'all stay tuned to that. The video is not over. Uh, we're just gonna go and do something different. So I gotta make we'll it you. realistic. Oh yeah, make it realistic. <laughs> over the field. Oh! Oh, it's down. Oh, that's more realistic, honestly. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> that's why I'm wearing a browning hat and shooting vanilla. <laughs> for the clay shoot, that's it. Let's head back to the barn and uh, I got a surprise for you guys I want to show you. So no one knows about this yet and uh, you guys will be the first to know. Kenz, what do you think? Are you going to um, come dove hunting, Kenz? No, because I suck. <laughs> I think what's worse is that I did really good in the beginning, yeah. aka my one shot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, 
Was Next it? time we just had no competition. No competition, just practice. Just, just practice? Yeah. What, do you want to shoot a few just to practice? Mm, what, so I can be more pissed off? <laughs> <laughs> I'm over it now. Yeah, oh, you're over it. Yeah, oh, we'll yeah. see. You're over it. <laughs> <laughs> She's totally over it, yeah. So we're back in the garage. As you guys know, we're getting ready for dove season, but the next season coming up is deer season. And that is the main season that we're focused on this year. And throughout the years, I've been able to figure out and narrow down what gear I do like, what gear I don't like, what I use on a day-to-day -day basis during hunting season. And luckily this year, I've been able to partner up with some of the best companies in the hunting industry. With scouting and getting ready for deer season, you're trying to put as many trail cameras out. Last year, I was running four to five cameras out of every brand, pretty much every brand. My wife hates me because of the bill that we had to pay for the trail cameras, the cell cams. So with that, I was trying to figure out which one works the best from picture quality to battery lifetime to subscription, how easy it is to run the app, everything. Out of the 25 to 30 cameras that I was running last year, the four Moultries that I had, they ran the best. So the good thing about Moultrie is there's 16 batteries in this bad boy. You don't have an SD card, so you don't have to worry about filling up an SD card, making sure the SD card's okay. All you do, flip this little antenna, flip it on, wait till it connects, and you're ready to rock and roll. It doesn't matter what service you have in the area, whatever connects best to this camera, that's what it'll run. If I ever needed a spot where I didn't know what service to use because you either have to pick Verizon or you have to pick AT&T, with this camera, it's just flip it up, turn it on, and it's gonna connect to the best service. Also, the battery life is awesome. And like I said, I'm super excited to be partnering up with Moultrie, so awesome camera and awesome people. So about three years ago, me and my best friend Dalton were searching for the best way to hunt that season. And this crazy thing came along called saddle hunting. That same best friend a few years back had fallen out of a tree, broken his back right there in front of me. So we were in search for the safest gear, the most comfortable gear, and honestly, just the best quality gear that we could use to be able to hunt out of a tree. That year we found tethered and that was not because of any promotions or anything like that. That was simply going out on our own and finding something that we thought was the best gear. So three years ago, we were lucky to find the best. We used the best and we've tested the best. And now luckily we're working with the best. So with that being said, I just want to run through the gear that I'm going to be using whenever I'm going to be hanging from a tree. And this is the new tethered lockdown saddle. The pockets are crazy. They're a lot easier. Before I had, before I was running the phantom saddle, which I'm still going to use. So for the past three years, I've been using the phantom saddle. I love it. I'm still going to be using it. But this year they have changed the game with the new lockdown saddle from the pockets, from the extended butt pad that goes back up. Haven't used it yet, but this season, that's what I'm gonna be running. And I'm gonna have the tethered fast pack on my back at all times, from camera gear, to extra clothes, to the one sticks, to the tethered platform. It's gonna be carrying in and out all my gear. With that, if you don't know Tethered, Tethered is known for their one stick. It is one of the lightest sticks on the market, and this comes in at less than a pound. So, pretty crazy, it's gonna be nice whether we're hunting public land or just a hanging hunt to be able to take these guys in and out, super light. And also I'm gonna be running the XL platform that Tethered has, so super excited. So with that being said, I'm super excited for hunting season, duck, dove, deer, everything. But for my deer season, that is two of the brands that I'm gonna be focusing on and that I'm gonna be using. To find a brand that really backs you and really believes in you is awesome and that is exactly what Moultrie and Tethered do, so. Thank you to both of them. All right, that is pretty much it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along, trying to get Kinsey ready for dove season and having a little bit of a competition at the same time. Let us know in the comments what we should compete in next. And if you enjoyed this video, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. It really does help the channel out, but that is pretty much it. I love you guys, and as always, boop.